<laughs> well, look at this. Yes, our plan has worked out an elephant and he's actually been swimming. You can see he's completely wet. He's been splashing around in the water down here at Chitwa Dam. Oh, this is wonderful. Really wonderful. I'm hoping he goes back into the water. Let's have a look. Oh, this is always a very, very pleasant surprise if we do get elephant down at the dam. For some reason, they really enjoy, they really enjoy coming down to swim and splash around in the water. It's just a lone bull. I don't see any others around. It's not unusual to find a bull by himself. Sometimes you find the bulls in small groups, two, three, four of them, moving around. Especially the younger bulls. Watch, there he goes. Yes, yes. <laughs> Look at that, he's completely on his side. <laughs> this is my favorite, everyone. I promise you, I, I can watch this for hours. And he seems to be having a lot of fun. how beautiful and th those white tusks are in contrast to the body now the body's very dark gray because he is so wet <laughs> oh yes wow look at that <laughs> we've got a breaching elephant everyone that's what's going on here a breaching elephant Seek truth, you say a dunking elephant. Look how, much, how that elephant's enjoying that water. That is wonderful. As I said, look at the contrast, those beautiful tusks against that dark skin. The light is perfect now. What words would you use? You don't really have to use words in sightings like this. It's just nice to sit and appreciate and and watch. I mean... This is special. This is one of my favorite things to see out in the bush when these elephants play and splash around in the water. <laughs> Kim, good afternoon to you. You're a new viewer, apparently, and you say it's almost like this elephant is performing just for us. It, it almost looks that way, doesn't it? <laughs> it just looks like he's having so much fun. Every now and then he goes and he tries to get a bit of food on the bank and then jumps back into the water. Kermi, you asked if elephants ever get water in their ears. I don't know. I'm possibly. I've never seen an elephant get out of the water though and jump on the side on one leg or two legs to get the water out their ears. <laughs> so I don't know. Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. I doubt it. Let's have a look. This fish eagle just took off from the dam I wonder look there it goes that beautiful African fish eagle well done Senzo oh. oh, he's probably going to some trees to the back there we may get another view of him later uh, I see where he landed we'll carry on watching our elephant for a while though I think Amazing.
Now in other parts of Southern Africa, and especially up in Botswana and Zambia, the, the um, elephants need to cross big rivers, deep rivers. So they're very used to swimming and they do enjoy it. And I often see, I've seen elephants, herds of elephants move through or cross a river and just their trunks sticking out of the water. An entire herd, even the youngsters. There's quite a breeze coming off of this dam at the moment. Very cool, cool breeze. Oh, has he had enough? Is he going to move off? Chitty chatty Meg, you say that was just too cute. Yeah, it was indeed. Meg, I hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> he's, he's definitely <laughs> he's behaving quite or in quite a boisterous manner this elephant I wonder if he isn't in a bit of must obviously we can't see now because he's completely wet so we can't see if he's sweating for, from his possibly in must I'm not sure as I said we can't tell now because he's completely wet look at that, that elephant swagger when they walk downhill <laughs> I enjoy seeing that <laughs> all right now I think uh, we're going to leave this elephant and his wonderful swagger and let's head across to somebody who also has a bit of a swagger. My